And now we are joined by senior forward Jasmine Walker. And again, please use this time to raise or lower your hand as necessary. Jasmine, I want to uh, just say congratulations to you and to your team on an outstanding run this year. And uh, now we're going to open this up for questions from the media. We're going to start with James Fletcher, Tuscaloosa News. James? Yeah, hey, Jasmine. I uh, just wanted to start off by asking you, what were those last few moments like um, when you get subbed out and you're sitting on the bench and, and just knowing as a senior um, that this is your last time here and every, looking back on everything that you, you've been able to accomplish at Alabama, what were you thinking about there? Uh, I don't know. Uh, at the same time, I was like, you know, this – it's my last time being in a Bama jersey. But at the same time, you know, I'm proud of my team. You know, we made, we did stuff, you know, people would be able to do in 20 years, 20 plus years, you know. I'm proud of these group of girls I get, I had got to experience this journey with. You know, I can always say that, you know, my senior year we made history. So that's what I'm most proud about. And then um, what's next for you? Or are you, um, looking forward at the, the WNBA draft at this point? Uh, as of right now, I haven't made up my decision yet. All right, James, thank you for those questions. And um, our next uh, question or questions will come from Katie Windham. Katie? Hey, Jasmine, it's Katie Windham from Bama Central. Um, you kind of just hit on it a little bit, but being from Alabama, uh, what does it mean for you to be able to bring this team and this program back to the NCAA tournament? Oh, it means a lot. Uh, you know, I've been in, I've been living in Alabama all my life. Uh, left and came back. You know, I just it was just a great environment for me. You know, it's home. You know, I always played for home, so I came back to home, and that's what I'm, I'm most used to. So I feel like that was the great, the best choice in my life was to come back home and play in front of all my friends and family, you know, it's close to home, so. And then to follow up uh, more specifically on the game, once your team kind of got in the deficit, how much pressure did you put on yourself as a senior leader and score, like, I need to score here, I need to get the ball to go through the hoop? Uh, I just let the game come to me. I wouldn't, I didn't feel pressured. Uh, you know, I just told them to stay the course, you know, just let the game come to you and just do be Alabama, play Alabama ball. That's all we can do. You know, it's a great Maryland team. You know, all we can do is play our game, and that's what we continue to do. Thank you. Thank you, Katie. We will now go to AP Stedman for his question or questions. Hey, Jasmine, it's AP Stedman of WHEP. Uh, congratulations on your career, and I would like to ask you, what are some of the best things you learned uh, from being around Coach Curry? Don't ever get down on yourself when things get hard. You know, always be who you can be and be the best version of you. She tell me every time things not going your way, you know, just keep your head up, hold your head up high and keep moving forward. You know, I always take those words with me every day because that's all I can do is control what I can control. Uh, Jasmine, you mentioned something about your un undecided about your WNBA uh, aspirations. So can you tell us what might be in going into your decision? Uh, no, it just, you know, I'm, I'll make my decision, you know, when I feel like it's time. Mm -hmm. is, is it a question of uh, your maybe not thinking of uh, pursuing basketball or is that the, the no. question in, in mind? Yeah. No, just thinking about it. Okay, thank you. Uh, do we have any other questions uh, from the media for Jasmine? Seeing none, I would like to say thank you very much, Jasmine, for joining us today. You and your teammates created lots of excitement this year. Congratulations for your accomplishments. Thank you so much.